prey, uh, may have, what may that be? There we are, stranger. Officer, we were scrounged. And prey, uh, may have, what may that be? There we are, stranger. Officer, we were scrounged. Isn't this a ghost town? Quick draw? If you ask me, I think we ought to disappear. Isn't this a ghost town? Quick draw? If you ask me, I think we ought to disappear. Isn't this a ghost town? Quick draw? If you ask me, I think we ought to disappear. Isn't this a ghost town? Quick draw? If you ask me, I think we ought to disappear. Louisiana over Lipton, 65 to 30. In Birmingham, 67% prefer the great taste of Louisiana. Louisiana secret? Louisiana just tastes a whole lot better. See how satisfying iced tea can taste. Final tally, Louisiana preferred two to one. It's the clear winner. I like a day that's not cloudy and a tea that's not cloudy. That's why I like Louisiana. Louisiana's got special tea leaves that keep it clear as a bell all day. Now, if you're drinking Lipton or Tetley, look at the box. It tells you what to do when it turns cloudy. Louisiana says nothing about cloudy. Because it doesn't get cloudy. Louisiana, the one tea that's always clear as a bell. That was given to me in Oregon. Uh, an old gentleman up there carved it. And he knows that I like walking sticks, especially unusual ones, so it's a gift. Oh, I have many. I have one with the head of a bird. I have uh, several Irish blackthorns, and, and uh, I, have, I have many carved and decorated canes that, that people have sent me, and uh, that people have sent me, and, uh, and uh, I've gotten as gifts. So uh, I have quite a collection. I love them. Uh, I collect owls. Owls and eagles. Them. Owls and eagles. I don't really know. I, I never count them. But uh, I think it's going to be pretty good. Uh, we're doing 11 instead of 8 this year. And uh, just the lawyers and doctor, yeah. Uh, yes, I think it, uh, it, it uh, would have been nice to have Hal with the group and the center because I enjoyed the show. I got a theory about that. I've been around the country quite a lot, as you know, and uh, I ask questions, and 
going to discuss things with people. And I think uh, it's possible, now this is just a theory from what I gathered, uh, they all liked uh, Hal very much, and they liked the idea of the show, but uh, the public is very funny. They may not know exactly why they reject something, but there's always a good reason. And uh, as I discussed the thing with people, occasionally I got a hint that uh, here was a senator, a U.S. senator, so, quote, he is also a politician. And I think that, uh, that the uh, American people don't quite have that conception of politicians. And I think uh, subconsciously they said this is not quite, you know, quite so. as threatening clouds in the sky, daring to stand in his way. Clouds he had to destroy at all costs. I'm Burl, and this is New Good Seasons Buttermilk Farm Style Salad Dressing. All you add is fresh milk and mayonnaise. Delicious. I'm Burl, and this is New Good Seasons Buttermilk Farm Style Salad Dressing. All you add is fresh milk and mayonnaise. Delicious. Folks, the big iced tea taste test is history, and the clear winner is... In Atlanta, it's Louisiana over Lipton, 65 to 30. In Birmingham, 67% prefer the great taste of Louisiana. Louisiana's secret? Louisiana just tastes a whole lot better. See how satisfying iced tea can taste. Final tally, Louisiana preferred 2 to 1. It's the clear winner. I like a day that's not cloudy and a tea that's not cloudy. That's why I like Louisiane. Louisiane's got special tea leaves that keep it clear as a bell all day. Now, if you're drinking Lipton or Tetley, look at the box. It tells you what to do when it turns cloudy. Louisiane says nothing about cloudy. Because it doesn't get cloudy. Louisiane. One tea that's always clear as a bell.
U.S. Senator, so, quote, he is also a politician. And he was always uh, really sort of a, the perfect man in the perfect position, you know, with the perfect attitude. And I think that uh, the uh, American people don't quite have that conception of politicians. And I think uh, subconsciously they that this is not quite, you know, quite so. cloudy and a tea that's not cloudy. That's why I like Louisiana. Louisiana's got special tea leaves that keep it clear as a bell all day. Now, if you're drinking Lipton or Tetley, look at the box. It tells you what to do when it turns cloudy. Louisiana says nothing about cloudy. Cause it doesn't get cloudy. Louisiana, the one tea that's always clear as a bell. That was given to me in Oregon. Uh, gentleman up there carved it. Like walking streets, especially unusual ones. It's a gift. Oh, I have many. I have one. the idea of the show, but uh, 
the public is very funny. They may not know exactly why they reject something, but there's always a good reason. And uh, as I have discussed the thing with people, uh, occasionally I got a hint that uh, here was a senator, a U.S. senator, so, quote, he is also a politician. And he was always uh, really sort of a, the perfect man in the perfect position, you know, with the perfect attitude. And I think that uh, the uh, American people don't quite have that conception of politicians. And I think uh, subconsciously they that this is not quite, you know, quite so. And, uh, and I was, uh, on 4th of July, I was in Bend, Oregon. We had... Uh, 17,000 people seated on the side of the river there, sitting on the grass. And we had a big time up there. We really celebrated the 4th of July. It all began in a faraway place called Zanzibar, across the bay from the city of Dar es Salaam in East Africa. This is Zanzibar. as threatening clouds in the sky, daring to stand in his way. Clouds he had to destroy at all costs. I'm Burl, and this is New Good Seasons Buttermilk Farm Style Salad Dressing. All you add is fresh milk and mayonnaise. Delicious. I'm Burl, and this is New Good Seasons Buttermilk Farm Style Salad Dressing. All you add is fresh milk and mayonnaise. Delicious. Folks, the big iced tea taste test is history, and the clear winner is... Louisiana. In Atlanta, it's Louisiana over Lipton, 65 to 30. In Birmingham, 67% prefer the great taste of Louisiana. Louisiana secret? Louisiana just tastes a whole lot better. See how satisfying iced tea can taste. Final tally, Louisiana preferred two to one. It's the clear winner. I like a day that's not cloudy and a tea that's not cloudy. That's why I like Louisiane. Louisiane's got special tea leaves that keep it clear as a bell all day. Now, if you're drinking Lipton or Tetley, look at the box. It tells you what to do when it turns cloudy. Louisiane says nothing about cloudy. Because it doesn't get cloudy. Ah, Louisiane, the one tea that's always clear as a bell. That was given to me in Oregon. Uh, an old gentleman up there carved it, and uh, he knows that I like walking sticks, especially unusual ones, so it's a gift. Oh, I have many. I have one with the head of a bird. I have uh, several Irish black thorns, and, and uh, I, have, I have many carved and decorated canes that people have sent me, and uh, that people have sent me, and, uh, and uh, I've gotten these gifts. So, uh, I have quite a collection, I love them. Uh, I collect owls, owls and eagles, owls and eagles. I don't really know, I, I never count them. But, uh, I think it's going to be pretty good. Uh, we're doing 11 instead of 8 this year. And uh, we've got the lawyer good on the count. Uh, yes, I think it, uh, it, it uh, would have been nice to have the owl. quite a lot, as you know, and uh, I ask questions and I discuss things with people, 
And I think uh, it's possible, now this is just a theory from what I gathered, uh, they all liked uh, Hal very much, and they liked the idea of the show, but uh, the public is very funny. They may not know exactly why they reject something, but there's always a good reason. And uh, as I discussed the thing with people, uh, occasionally I got a hint that uh, here was a senator, a U.S. senator, so, quote, he is also a politician. And he was always uh, really sort of a, the perfect man in the perfect position, you know, with the perfect attitude. And I think that uh, the uh, American people don't quite have that conception of politicians. And I think uh, subconsciously they that this is not quite, you know, quite so. Uh, and I was, uh, on the 4th of July, I was in Bend, Oregon. We had uh, 17,000 people seated on the side of the river there, sitting on the grass. And we had a big time up there. And really celebrated the 4th of July. It all began in a faraway place called Zanzibar, across the bay from the city of Dar es Salaam. Africa. This is Zanzibar before the trouble started, a lazy island in the tropical Indian Ocean. For as long as anyone there can remember, the people have always raised in spicy clothes and been ruled by sleepy sultans. The latest and greatest of them all was the Sultan Majid. The Sultan enjoyed his power because he truly cared for his people. He kept them busy and prosperous by building the biggest clove industry in the whole world. The harbor at Zanzibar was not very deep, so ships had to anchor far offshore. Day after day, the porters waded through the water to take the cloves out to the great ships. Year after year, the people of Zanzibar grew more and more clothes the people of the world, and the lines of orders grew longer and longer. It was a still moonlit night when the Aban Khan led the angry farmers on a most evil mission. In his crazed mind, he saw the hippos as threatening clouds in the sky, daring to stand in his way. Clouds he had to destroy and all fall. I barely touched anything. I'm sure that whatever minor alteration may have occurred will go completely unnoticed. I could be any kid riding a time machine. See? My hair is completely different. Enough talk. I know you are the one who changed the garage code. And me, Uncle. So, what's the garage code? Crash. Right. Thanks. Oh, no! Carl! Somebody's stealing the time machine! Not me, Carl. Some guy in a... Bowler hat! Ah, oh, great. They're gonna find some way to blame me for this. Right. And do you want to know what else isn't funny? Giant ants stole the time machine. And you're all wound up. Let's just calm down, take a breather, and watch the sunset. I'm on it. Captain Future requesting apology. Shh. All brought to you by Cornelius Robinson. Yep. 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 My dad. He's an incredibly talented inventor. Some even call him the founder of the future. That's his motto. Yeah. You know, Dad failed way more times than he succeeded. But he kept going and never gave up. And neither should you. And that's why you're gonna go back to the science fair and fix your memory skin. Seeing your mom isn't the answer to this. That's in the past. Your future is with the memory scan. Just as I feared, the ship is almost out of fuel. We got a code right on our hands. Soldier, I don't have time to explain every last detail to you. We need to get this puppy back to my house pronto. Carl, this is serious. You haven't told anybody about that, have you? Great. Now, go to call for the rap. Pretty amazing story, huh? Really amazing. Have you not been paying attention? Do you not remember the motto? Keep moving. So one little failure. to ride the time machine, and we have got to see the future, and they were many. Moving 
Officer Devil, I'm going on a vacation. I'm going to the islands. I mean Wahoo, Molokai, Maui, and Ma see you when I get back from my vacation, officer. Good night. Aloha, aloha, anuka, anuka, homa, homa, a fond embrace, your funny face until. Officer Devil, I'm going on a vacation. I'm going to the islands. I mean Wahoo, Molokai, Maui, and Ma see you when I get back from my vacation, officer. Good night. Aloha, aloha, anuka, anuka, homa, homa, a fond embrace, your funny face, until Oh, hi, Officer Devil. I'm going on a vacation. I'm going to the islands. I mean Wahoo, Molokai, Maui, and Ma See you when I get back from my vacation, Officer. Okay, gang. Five o'clock. Everybody in the zoo, rise and shine. Hit the deck, fellas. On your feet, Wally. Ready for your exercises. And a one, a two, one, a two, one, 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 two, oh! And you remember what we always say? Forget it. Hmm? Here, here, where do you think you're going? Come back, Wally. It's against the rules to run away. That sounds like Wally. Hang on, Wally. I'll call an ambulance right away. Am I interrupting anything? Bother to get up, Wally, old pal. Right you are, Wally. Something is up. It's your birthday. Surprise! Yes, it seems like only yesterday that you were spending your first birthday here at the zoo. Oh, you were a cute little rascal. Happy birthday, little Wally. Now enjoy yourself, but don't wander away from your cage and be a good little alligator. Oh, well, Wally, I believe in letting bygones be bygones. Now, Wally, you're a full-grown boy. It's time you got rid of your ideas of escaping from the zoo. And here's something to help you forget. <clears throat> and now remember, Wally, enjoy your new present. Why, with your guitar, you can organize a band. Okay, gang, five o'clock. Everybody in the zoo, rise and shine. Hit the deck, fellas. On your feet, Wally. Ready for your exercises. And a one, two, 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 oh! And you remember what we always say? Forget it. Here, here, where do you think you're going? Come back, Wally. It's against the rules to run away. That sounds like Wally. Hang on, Wally. I'll call an ambulance right away. Am I interrupting anything? Mother to get up, Wally, old pal. Right you are, Wally. Something is up. It's your birthday. Surprise! Yes, it seems like only yesterday that you were spending your first birthday here at the zoo. Oh, you were a cute little rascal. Happy birthday, little Wally. Now enjoy yourself, but don't wander away from your cage and be a good little alligator. Oh, well, Wally, I believe in letting bygones be bygones. Now, Wally, you're a full-grown boy. It's time you got rid of your ideas of escaping from the zoo. And here's something to help you forget. <clears throat> and now remember, Wally, enjoy your new present. Why, with your guitar, you can organize a band. Okay, gang, five o'clock. Everybody in the zoo, rise and shine. Hit the deck, fellas. On your feet, Wally. Ready for your exercises. And a one, a two, a one, a two, one, 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 two, oh! And you remember what we always say? Forget it. Here, here, where do you think you're going? Come back, Wally. It's against the rules to run away. That sounds like Wally. Hang on, Wally. I'll call an ambulance right away. Am I interrupting anything? Bother to get up, Wally, old pal. Right?
money, enjoy your new present. Why, with your guitar, you could organize a band. Scouts bring in the good deeds. Easy, church. Have more respect for the uniforms, ain't no more. You've done your good deed. Let's just hope the pawn shop takes retreads. Say any more, Betty, until he reads you your rights. Try, kid, the old save to life trick. He might buy it. You know how we feel about you. Call my agent, tell him to put the concert tour on hold.